Hey guys, Asha from EpochNews.com over here at the IDF 2011 in San Francisco. Still at the Moscone Center and we're still talking Ultrabooks. So that was the big topic uh, during the Ottolini keynote today. And over here we're taking a look at the new Toshiba Protégé Z5830. Actually, you know what? I can still remember the product name because I just put it over here on a sticky note. Anyways, um, this is by far the lightest Ultrabook we've had in our hands over here. This is like, I said, like 2.5 uh, American pounds, which is, uh, for people that are using real measurements in the world, it's like about 1.2 kilograms. And uh, actually, you can really tell, because this is the weight of a, of a netbook on a 13.3 inch device. It's using a nice matte screen, 1366 by 768 should be the resolution. I would guess that this is Windows 7 Professional, maybe Windows 7 Ultimate. Um, it comes with SSDs up to, I think, one, 128 gigabyte SSDs in there, right? Okay, so between 32 and 128, because I'm pretty sure that they're not going to sell one with 32 gigabyte, because this would be more like a Chromebook or something. Then, um, we, let's take a quick look around the system. As you can see, it is a super thin. We have jacks for the microphone, the headset. There's an SD card reader. Um, there are some two speakers here. We have a couple of status LEDs here, and also some status LEDs over there. Um, there's a USB 3.0, a Kensington key lock, we have an Ethernet connector over here on the back, two more USB 2.0, an HDMI out, connector for your PSU, and a VGA out. So when it comes to I.O. ports, this is really top notch, I would say. Um, let's take a look at the Schicklet keyboard here, which is, geez, it's great. Great feedback, I really like that. It's super thin, uh, huge trackpad, and compared to all these other uh, Ultrabooks that we've seen so far, it doesn't have these integrated mouse buttons, which is great. It also comes with a fingerprint reader that you can use for storing passwords, etc. Uh, over here we have the power button, and this is any kind of, what's that? Eco utility, any kind of proprietary software from Toshiba. And over here you have this little uh, uh, button where you can just switch on and off um, the, the track pad, which comes in handy you now if you're, when you're typing a lot and your the wrist of your or the palm of your hand is just heading over um, the trackpad. Besides that, I think that's a 1.3 megapixel camera over here. And that's it pretty much. But now just take a look how thin this is. Just uh, this is my Samsung Galaxy S2. Look at this. That's not too bad, right? And I tell you one thing, this is just super light. It really feels good. It's kind of brushed aluminum case here. And I'm pretty sure if Toshiba is releasing this at a decent price point, this is gonna sell. Really, really gorgeous Ultrabook. The new Toshiba Portage. You know what, guys? I forgot about this name again. Portage Z5. 80, 30, whatever. Mm -hmm. you know, they really, really need to work on the product names in the future, I tell you that. Anyways, besides that, I really love it. I'm Sasha for NetbookNews.com. Thanks for watching.